everyone so here's another review of one of the products that I shared in my Korean cosmetics haul and it's the Holika Holika Aqua Petite Jelly BB Cream it's a little 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 bit light for my skin but because I use bronzer and I like contour and stuff um, it works great but I wanted to use it for a while before doing a complete review um, I love it I this is this might be one of my top BB creams that I've ever tried um, what I like is that it doesn't give a gray cast like most BB creams. It doesn't feel thick and heavy. It's very, very light. Um, you know, it's the gel formula, but it really feels like whipped rather than like gel. It feels like chocolate mousse or something. Um, so I like that. I like that it's very thin. It goes on and it feels cool and it feels thin. I just kind of uh, dot it on my face. So one dip of the spatula is enough for my whole face. So I just dip it all over my face and then I use my Sigma round top brush and I just buff it into my skin. It doesn't have as much coverage as like a full cover foundation, but after this I usually put on concealer onto my problem areas anyways. Um, so it works fine, like it's what I'm wearing today. I've been wearing it every day for at least a week, I wanna say. Um, and I don't find that it uh, fades so much. The only areas that I find that I to me was like noticeable that like um, throughout the day I was like oh like I can see my skin through it is right around here um, because I kind of have like redness like around my nose but it's also probably because I touch my face a lot and that's probably an area that I touch more but I just never really noticed it before because all the other foundations I use are more full coverage um, so that's the only thing like I feel like I would need to kind of touch up um, you know like say you did your makeup in the morning and you were going out in the evening you might want to put like powder on again I'm one of those people once my makeup's on in the morning that's it I never mess with it again um, so I guess that's kind of the only thing I do love that there's SPF in it I love that it's really lightweight um, I love that it has you know it's a BB cream so it has a lot of um, other good benefits to it so I definitely think this is going to be what I'm going to be using in the summertime rather than a full coverage heavy foundation um, and I also like that it doesn't like wipe off on stuff um, yeah and I really like that even close up you can't see it on your skin like I feel like your skin just kind of soaks it up whereas like like when I'm wearing full coverage foundation I feel like my skin looks good but like if you're close up you can tell I'm wearing makeup that's why my skin looks good whereas I feel like this kind of like soaks more into your skin so it does look a lot more natural so in the summer like this paired with a really natural bronzer would just make you look like you have really nice fresh clean natural skin so I really really love this um, and I got this off of the Momo Mango site as well so if you're looking for a good BB cream or a good foundation for the summertime I would totally suggest this so anyways I hope that was helpful and I'll talk to you later bye